He played Aquaman, not a supporting character like Mira. It's just not comparable. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 post Depp v. Heard revelations. She felt like she had let down all of these women because she had more evidence than most people do. For this list, we're looking at new information that's come to light and events that have occurred since this highly publicized trial reached its verdict on June 1st, 2022. Have your thoughts changed since Depp v. Heard ended? Let us know in the comments. Number 10. Heard's Post-Trial Motions Neither the plaintiff nor the defendant came out of the trial unscathed. However, the jury only found Depp libel on one count of defamation, while Heard was found libel on all three of hers. She has lost so much credibility to the public that it's going to be very hard for her to bring any sort of claim. Heard's team announced plans to appeal shortly after, with attorney Elaine Bretterhoff sounding optimistic about their chances. One month following the trial, Heard's lawyers asked for the verdict to be overturned. The courts, especially judges, are very reluctant to overturn something that a jury has already decided. Seeking a new trial, they argued that Heard wasn't behind the headline. Depp urged the jury in his favor, and one juror was seemingly misleading about his age. Juror number 15, who is 52 years old, was not the one who was supposed to serve on the jury. Judge Penny S. Ascarati turned down Heard's request, noting that the jury followed the rules and the juror in question was vetted. Ascarati wrote, quote, there is no evidence of fraud or wrongdoing. Number nine, Heard could have gotten a bigger divorce settlement. Not long after Judge Ascarati declined Heard's mistrial request, over 6,000 pages of court documents were released. According to these court documents, Heard's divorce settlement was only a fraction of what she could have received. While he was still married to Heard, Depp filmed Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Men Tell No Tales. Heard would have been entitled to half of this community property asset, which was valued at, quote, tens of millions of dollars. Against the advice of her attorneys, Heard walked away from this payout. Heard's lawyers told her that she was being, quote, amazingly true to your word, that this is not about the money. Heard pledged to donate the $7 million she did receive to charity, although she's yet to give the full sum. Number 8. Evidence and Testimony Depp's Team Tried to Block Testifying for Heard, actress Ellen Barkin accused Depp of chucking a wine bottle at her during their courtship. Dr. Don Hughes and Dr. David Spiegel supported Heard as well, believing that Depp caused her trauma. Dr. Amy Banks also claimed that Heard was a domestic violence victim. Depp's attorneys sought to have these testimonies excluded from the trial. Additionally, his legal team did not want Depp's burnt corpse text conversation with Paul Bettany to be presented. It's been reported that Depp's lawyers were successful in blocking some of the evidence from the jury. However, sources also suggest that Judge Ascarati didn't sign off on these motions, meaning that they were still taken into consideration. In any case, it's all out in the open now. Number 7. Accusations of Audio and Photo Manipulation During the trial, Depp's legal team accused Heard of doctoring photos to make her face appear redder. Uh, the colors have been uh, modified in an editor. Objection, Your Honor. This has been publicly discussed at great length, but Heard's legal team also made similar accusations against Depp. Forensic expert Julian Ackert analyzed metadata from audio and photos that Depp submitted into evidence. Ackert testified that he uncovered, quote, anomalies that call into question the authenticity of the multimedia documents, such as, quote, missing creation dates and or modification dates. Heard's side claimed that these items, quote, were modified days before their production in this case, noting that some of the audio clips weren't submitted in their entirety. On more than one occasion, Heard's team asked to have the originals released, but their requests were repeatedly rejected. Number 6. The Late Logan As a teenager, Heard lost a friend named Logan in an automobile accident. During an interview with Whitney Enriquez, Depp's legal team asked various questions about her sister's connection to Logan. They inquired if Heard had ever been romantic or violent with Logan, which Enriquez denied. Enriquez also claimed that Heard had never been violent towards her. Depp's team remained fixated on Logan, asking if Heard had seen him the day of the crash, if she was in the car when it happened, and if her suspended driver's license was linked to his death. Enriquez shot all of these questions down, insisting that Heard was, quote, devastated by the loss and that her suspended license had nothing to do with the death of her friend. What's more, Heard's legal team asserted that she was, quote, nowhere near the county in which the accident occurred at the time. 
This deposition wasn't spotlighted during the trial, but it's since come out with the unsealed court documents. Number 5. Marilyn Manson Texts The unsealed documents have divulged several topics that Depp's legal team did not want touched upon. Arguably the most eyebrow-raising is, quote, references to and evidence regarding Marilyn Manson. Various women, including ex-fiancé Evan Rachel Wood, have accused Manson of abuse, which he denies. Depp's attorneys feared that his relationship with the heavy metal artist would make him appear guilty by association. While Manson came up during the trial, Depp's team managed to omit text conversations between the two. I once gave uh, Marilyn Manson a pill uh, so that he would stop talking so much. <laughs> In 2016, Manson reportedly texted, quote, I got an Amber 2.0, and quote, Lindsay just pulled an Amber on me, please delete, apparently referencing his current wife, Lindsay Usyk. In a follow-up text, Depp sympathizes with Manson, who goes on to ask for, quote, asylum, believing the cops were after him. Number 4. Depp's team didn't want their client undergoing psychological evaluation. While multiple doctors have analyzed Heard's mental health, Depp's legal team barred their client from receiving similar treatment going into the trial. According to the newly released documents, Depp's team argued that he, quote, is not alleging harm based on a specific physical or mental injury. Depp's attorneys went on to claim that Heard's actions didn't cause him, quote, a specific psychiatric injury or, quote, to experience unusually severe emotional distress. They thus concluded that Depp did not require a psychiatric examination. However, Depp's testimony in court discussed several specific alleged incidents that left him injured and distressed. Number 3. Heard's Binder Worth of Notes Following the verdict, Heard spoke with Savannah Guthrie in an NBC interview. How could they make a judgment? How could they not come to that conclusion? Heard said that around the same time that her relationship with Depp commenced, she started telling her therapist about the alleged abuse. According to Heard, her doctor wrote enough notes to fill a binder over the years. Guthrie found that Heard had been seeing her therapist since 2012, making accusations of hitting, death threats, and more. The therapist's notes were not shared with the jury, though, as they were declared hearsay. It wouldn't be until after the trial that Heard was able to make the notes public. In response, Depp's representatives accused the defendant's team of, quote, repeating, reimagining, and re-litigating matters that have already been decided by the court. Number 2. Disney's Frustrations with Depp's Behavior Tracy Jacobs, Depp's former agent, testified at the trial, although some topics were off-limits. Heard's legal team wasn't permitted to question Jacobs about an alleged incident where Depp was drunk and high on TV, prompting Disney studio executives to express serious concern. The TV appearance itself wasn't specified in the unsealed documents, but Disney apparently had similar issues with Depp on Pirates 5. Now that is a blatant fabrication. Disney supposedly told Jacobs that Depp's behavior was not, quote, going to be tolerated, and that the company was, quote, not going to put up with this. Heard's team further asserted, quote, there was no love between Johnny and Disney, given the Pirates 5 situation. Jacobs also couldn't discuss allegations that Depp, quote, lied to the LAPD. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few other revelations. Heard's comparable actors list. Heard's team claimed her stature had been on par with Jason Momoa, Zendaya, and others. They are not comparable. Jason Momoa was Aquaman. Uh, Chris Pine was Captain Kirk. Gal Gadot was Wonder Woman. Russian Interference Claims Depp's team sought to exclude alleged evidence of a Russian bot campaign. Heard's team asked Depp to describe detailed violent incidents. Depp's team argued that this was, quote, unlikely to lead to the discovery of admissible evidence. It, it could begin with a slap, it could begin with a, a shove, um, it could begin with, you know, throwing a TV remote at my head. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Herd's Explicit Photos This trial was more than personal for Depp and Herd, but it almost went a step further. Heard's counsel pointed to several pieces of evidence that they wanted to be excluded, deeming them, quote, irrelevant personal matters. This included footage of a reality show featuring Whitney Enriquez and details on dating histories. 
Most notably, Depp tried to submit nude photos of his ex-wife as evidence. He also wanted to introduce Heard's short time as an exotic dancer. They doubled down by saying Amber's nude images, as well as her past as an exotic dancer, happened years before she met the pirate star. According to Heard's team, this evidence seemed designed to imply that she had once been a sex worker. None of this was presented to the jury, but these unsealed documents paint an even more bizarre portrait of the trial we ultimately got. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.